Alright, hey everybody. Sorry, I've been pretty busy lately. I haven't been at the computer so much, just been busy with other things outside and a lot of yard work and such. <laughs> but I do want to touch on something that broke in the headlines last week on March 27th, and that was about the WNBA player Sydney Weiss. And she is the first player to officially test positive for coronavirus. Although my last video I did with Teresa Plaisance, I mentioned that they weren't sure or they weren't sure if she did or didn't have it, but she was just making headlines about having symptoms of coronavirus. So, but here on again March 27th, we have our first confirmed case of a player from the WNBA. And I know Zach did a really good video on comparing this with Kobe and everything to do with that, but I just wanted to document it too for myself so I remember it better and just for everyone else, just the, you know, more clues for the WNBA season, I'm sure. But just to get started, the first thing that I definitely noticed was on the Jerusalem Post, they shared her tweet about, you know, I tested positive for Corona or COVID-19. I am feeling well, fortunate to only show mild symptoms, yada, yada. But up, up here it says, Again, Sydney Weiss is the first WNBA player to test positive for coronavirus. She says, the symptoms I showed were lost of taste and smell. They were newer symptoms, but they are symptoms. So just to show that this was posted on this website, but also that she played for an Israeli team in the 2018-2019 off season. You know, so that, that stands out just for future reference, I'm sure. But Again, like how the comparison is pretty obvious if you're looking or paying attention how Sydney Weiss has similarities with Kobe Bryant, but that's only by the number that she wears, number 24, and she plays for an LA team, LA Sparks. So just seeing that, and then I think it's pretty funny how they use this picture on her, her description or her Wicca page. Because again, Kobe and Kobe's known for that tongue hanging out and also Michael Jordan, but still they could have used any picture, but just to show the similarities even further. And then do note that she is 24 years old. And while we're talking about Kobe, I know a lot of us who follow, uh, you know, Gamatria Effect News know this already, but in case any of my friends just stumble on my page, if you're not aware, Kobe Bryant is actually buried in Corona Del Mar Cemetery. And Corona Del Mar, like all this talk about Corona, and especially after he died, how it really took over and whatever. So just seeing that and knowing the gematria of Corona Del Mar and then comparing it to coronavirus, it's, it's just right there in your face. <laughs> it's a two out of the four cipher match. With coronavirus, the 56 and the 70. And so just to point out that little connection. And then knowing that she plays for the LA Sparks, LA Sparks equals 56, just like coronavirus equals 56. And again, Wuhan, where this virus supposedly came from, Wuhan, China. Wuhan is a two out of the four cipher match with WNBA, 68 and 23. And then I did find this clip where it says Sydney Weiss positive for coronavirus to Gen Z. She says, have to take precautions more seriously. So when you take those quotations there, run that in Gamadria, it equals 155. Just again, like again, like coronavirus 155. And then one thing I did notice is from the day that Kobe died, January 26, 2020, to what is Sydney's birthday, June 16th, her upcoming birthday. It's actually 142 days apart. And another coronavirus number, 142, because again, we have four ciphers we mess with. And so like these three ciphers, yeah, they definitely hit talking about just her in this whole coronavirus uh, testing positive thing. But then also if you were to run Kobe's death date to the day that this news made the headlines about her having coronavirus. It's 61 days apart, and that's just like her last name, Weiss, 
equals 61. So, I mean, there's no denying that this has everything to do with Kobe Bryant and just like the female mimicking her or supposedly, I don't, you know, honestly, I'm not even sure who this girl lady is. I'm not that, I mean, I'm pretty familiar with my WNBA players, but maybe, I don't know. Her name doesn't stick out, so I don't know if she was like, she's not the baller of the WNBA, I know that, <laughs> but just to see that she has the number and plays for that team, that's all you need to know, and knowing this whole coronavirus riddle with her. So yeah, I guess I'll leave it there. See ya.